And now, your local weather authority forecast. Your full start to your Friday, and this will allude to more beautiful weather conditions, not as hot conditions, and more chances for much needed rainfall, although rain will be very sporadic and not really amounting to too much. This is the beautiful live look at Odessa early on your Friday morning. We do notice the golden yellows and oranges along the horizon, pinks and purples highlighting the clouds well off to our south and east, and also even off to our east northeast this morning from time to time trying to make their way southward, but kind of dissipating as they try to make their way in places like Midland and Odessa, partly to mostly clear skies right now. Satellite and radar showing, though, parts of the basin raining, and the bulk of the rainfall, though, generally north of our viewing area in Lubbock and La Mesa, clipping the La Mesa this morning, and some of the light rain activity also near Carlsbad and Hobbs. The general trajectory of these clouds, as I mentioned, moving southward, but dissipating just a little bit as, again, they make their way toward Midland and Odessa. But still going to be a hot day, but just not quite as hot as what we have been seeing because of the more clouds. Still, we're going to be seeing dangerous heat levels from the Davis Mounds, Guadalupe Mounds, Marfa and Alpine, where an excessive heat warning is in effect too. 9 p.m. Central Time tomorrow, 8 p.m. Mountain Time. Temperatures in the high 90s, lower triple digits in the mountainous terrain. For the rest of the basin, very hot as well. Heat advisory in effect till to tomorrow and 9 p.m. Central Time, 8 p.m. Mountain Time, including Midland and Odessa. So make sure you guys stay hydrated and limit your time outdoors because temperatures won't be at least 100 for several hours on end. But we got ways to go. Partly cloudy, 79 right now in the tall city with a relative humidity right now at 52%. South southeastern breeze right around nine miles per hour. Sun rises in a few minutes at 6:53 a.m. As that sun rises, temperature skyrocketing. The atmosphere will still be pretty humid this morning, so the clouds and light rain showers may get very close to Midland and Odessa, but likely eluding the Petroplex. But as we have throughout the day, more rain is possible near Carlsbad Hobbs down to the Van Horn region. After the heat up, we could be seeing a few isolated weak thunderstorms from time to time. Average high 96. We got to 107 yesterday. Today, slightly cooler, but still hot at 105 with more humid air, more breezy weather and winds coming generally from the south and east, supplying the warm up. But the humidity in the atmosphere, 70s to start, 80s in northern areas, heating up in the high 90s and triple digits, at least 110 in Pecos, right around 105 today in, in the tall city and also big spring before cooling off in the 80s overnight with leftover clouds and persistent winds from the south southeast right around 10 to 20 miles per hour. Ample sunshine will be the big story this weekend. Right around 103 tomorrow, a little bit drier, but a little bit more humid, more sunshine and slightly lower temperatures on Sunday at 101. Few clouds and slightly cooler air, but still hot air will be the big story. So again, please make sure you guys are weather aware and stay safe out there. We are going to be seeing the return of temperatures very close to record ter territory, though, by next week. And make sure you guys check in with our chief meteorologist, Chase Menendez, tonight at 5, 6, and 10.